Sala Sala is a man who does his research. When he began taking a more hands-on role in his father's popular Drake neighborhood halal grocery store, he noticed Ethiopian injera bread was flying off the shelves. A people person by nature, he started asking customers questions. He quickly learned it wasn't just Ethiopians who liked the specialty bread made with teff flour. People of all nationalities, especially Americans, liked the Ethiopian staple. His interest was piqued when his quest for information led him to Sophia Umar, an Ethiopian caterer. Sala had always been interested in the business side of food. Specifically, he wanted to open a restaurant. Sophia wanted to expand the reach of her traditional Ethiopian dishes. It was a natural partnership. Sala, a Somalian by birth who lived in Egypt before immigrating to the United States as a child, admits he didn't know much about Ethiopian cuisine when the two started conceptualizing, but he did his research, traveling to major markets throughout the Midwest to try Ethiopian restaurants. He thought educating people about Ethiopian fare would be the biggest challenge to opening in Des Moines, but that wasn't the case. It was time. Ethiopian cuisine is usually a full-service and time-intensive hospitality experience, explains Sala. We were opening in a small space. That was not going to be profitable. Sala and Sophia settled on a fast, casual approach similar to Chipotle. Customers stand at the counter and pick a base, injera or rice, add vegetables and meat, then watch the assembly. Patrons love it. Finding a building for the restaurant also came together quickly. Sala bought the former home of Fernando's Mexican Grill on University Avenue from one of his mentors, Khalid Abdallah. Khalid really helped me understand the limited service model and spent hours answering my questions, said Sala. He wanted me to succeed. Abdallah relocated his own successful restaurant down the street, but left much of the equipment for Sala to get started. Gersha opened in January 2020. We worried about opening in the middle of a pandemic, reflects Sala, but we'd come that far and the support has been overwhelming. Sala knows his restaurant has enhanced diversity in the Des Moines food scene, in cuisine type, ownership, and employee base. But his advice to other hopeful restaurateurs is universal. Do your research. You may have to open a restaurant that isn't what you eat at home. Then commit and work in your business. If you're there, you'll see what needs to be improved, concludes Sala with a bright smile. Work as hard as your employees and appreciate them like family. You'll live your American dream with them and beside them. In recognition of his entrepreneurship and for the positive contribution he's had in expanding the culinary flavors in Des Moines, Sala Sala is the 2021 Iowa Restaurant Association Faces of Diversity honoree.